Hi, I'm Stephen Otwell with River Valley Tractor, here to talk about the L2501 package deal we have to offer, which consists of a L2501 Kubota tractor with a LA525 loader, a Land Pride BB1260 box blade, and a Land Pride RCR1260 rotary cutter. So let's get this thing off and look at it. All right, today we're talking about the Kubota L2501 tractor. This tractor comes in two variations, a DT or a hydrostat. Today we're looking at a DT model, or what we call a gear drive. Starting at the front of the tractor here is the power plant, a 25-horse Kubota diesel engine. Kubota is the number one diesel engine manufacturer in the world. And the L2501 is the number one selling tractor in Arkansas. But we got a metal hood, unlike a lot of our competitors. This tractor, as I said, is a gear drive, so here is the gear shift to select your, your speed ranges, one, two, three, and four. We've also got transmission ranges of low, high, and reverse here. This is gonna give you eight forward speeds and four reverse speeds to choose from. We also have the four-wheel drive engagement or disengage. The tractor is a four-wheel drive. Sometimes you may not wanna use that. We've got a differential lock lever here push down when you get in those sloppy conditions to lock both the rear tires in where you got everything pulling. Now let's talk about the Kubota LA525 loader. This loader is built by Kubota, matched to the L2501 for the correct performance. The LA525 has about a thousand pound lift capacity, comes in two different versions, either pin on bucket as you see here today, or a quick attach bucket. The quick attach option allows you to pull two levers, remove the bucket for a hay spear, pallet fork, all sorts of attachments. Compared to our competition, this loader is different because it is a true quick attach loader. This loader can be removed in a matter of minutes with no tools. Very easily, you're gonna crank the engine, curl your bucket a little, take some pressure off the main pins, remove this pin from each side of the loader frame. Got color-coded hoses here with quick attach. Disconnect these, push down on your lever, back out from under your loader reverse for hooking back up. So we have the Land Pride RCR 1260 rotary cutter hooked to the 2501. Land Pride is owned by Kubota. So it's performance matched to the 2501 tractor. This is a five foot rotary cutter with a 40 horse gearbox. The gearbox has a three year limited warranty. It's a three point hook up here using your draft arms and pins and your center link. Pretty simple. The draft links just slide over these pins and you've got a little clip pin to hold that on each side. The top link adjustable pin hooking into the top of it. Slide your PTO shaft on, spring pin locked to come off just the reverse, unlock it, slide it, take your pins out. We also offer a quick hitch option that makes this even easier. Okay, so looking underneath the RCR 1260, we've got a stump jumper where the blades are attached to, instead of hitting a rock or a stump and damaging your gearbox, it's gonna ride right over it. The rubber flaps back here in the back are for safety, discharge area, keep debris from flying out, hitting a vehicle, hitting a person. All right, so here we have the Land Pride BB1260 box blade, again, made by Land Pride, owned by Kubota, matched to our 2501. This box blade has heat treated scar fires in the front with heat treated replaceable tips, reversible cutting blades on the rear, also heat treated for longer life. These blades can be reversed if you wear the front one out quicker than the rear, you can just reverse them instead of replacing them. Box blade's a good tool for leveling out your driveway, moving rock, moving dirt, all sorts of things. All right, to operate the transmission on the L2501 DT, of course we're gonna crank the tractor up, we're gonna engage our clutch, we're gonna decide if we wanna be in low range or high range, low range being for heavier work, high range normally for higher speeds of transport or light work. So we choose our range, then we're gonna choose our gear, first, second, third, or fourth, depending on the speed we wanna go. We're gonna ease off on the clutch and begin operation. After we ease off the clutch, tractor starts moving, we're gonna control our engine speed right here. 
slower or faster. The more power we got, faster we go. If we're not going fast enough, we want to go up a gear or vice versa. If we're going too fast, we want to go down a gear. All right, we have the loader control valve here. Very simple to operate. Pull back to pick the loader up. Push forward to put the loader down. Pull towards you to curl the bucket up. Push away from you to dump the bucket. This is a lock for this control valve. The reason we would want to lock that is if we've got our loader up and we're transporting down the road pretty high speed, we don't want to accidentally hit that lever and drop that bucket damage it or damage the ground. All right, here we have our brake control. We have a brake lock. If you push it in, locks the brakes. If you're putting on a trailer or if you're on a hill, so now the tractor won't roll. To disengage, just simply press the brake levers again and the lock comes out by itself. We have a foot throttle lever right here in case you do not want to use the hand throttle. Here is our PTO engagement on and off, very simple. Our three-point hitch control to raise and lower our implement. We push down to put our implement down, pick up to pull it up. There's an adjustable stop we can move once you figure out exactly where you want your implement so you don't push it too far down. All right, so I'm parked back on our 18 foot dual axle pipe top trader that completes our package deal. I wanna mention our tractor has a two year basic warranty with a six year limited engine powertrain warranty. So anything encased in oil, six year warranty. Huge in the industry. Any first time buyers, if you're not sure what you want or what you need, we'll be glad to come out and do a free evaluation at your property, look around, see what you need. Maybe you think you need a tiller, but you need a box blade. Maybe you don't know. We'll be glad to come out, make recommendations, and build you a custom package. Maybe you don't need what we're seeing on this trailer, but we can customize to your needs. Come see us at River Valley Tractor.